how do. Right, I've had uh, letter number two from Equator. Uh, what's this then? Uh, £235 enforcement stage and £110 sale or disposal. But of course it's uh, got a font signature again, so, and it doesn't say the uh, name of it, it just says enforcement manager. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give them a bell and this time I'm not going to tell them that it's recording, so it's their hard cheese. And what number do we need? Let's have a look. Uh, is there a number on here? Oh, eight four four five six one eight eight oh seven. Okay, put the microphone in the right place this time. <laughs> Cheers. Good afternoon, and thank you for calling Equity Limited. Please be advised that your call may be recorded for monitoring and training purposes. Really. Welcome to Equita. Please enter the Equita reference number. This is located at the top right hand corner of our correspondence. Please enter your four digit SIM number. This is located below the Equita reference number. Thank you. Please wait whilst we check your case details. From, uh... Your case is currently being reviewed by one of our collection team for review really? to an enforcement agent. Really? When the enforcement agent visits, Additional charges will become payable. Please choose from the following options. Press 1 to pay your debt in full. No. Press 2 if you would like to make arrangements to pay. Press 3 if you have had your goods removed. <laughs> Press 4 for all other inquiries. Please wait whilst I connect you to an operator. Please wait while I connect you to an operator. Oh, straight through. Good afternoon. Can I take our reference number, please? Yeah, 1573. Yeah. 8979. Sorry, I think the line cut out a little bit there, so 1573. 8979. Okay, and the name on the account? It's got um, Jonathan Dow. Right, okay, and is that yourself? Well, I'm representative for him. Okay, and your name is? John. John, okay. Yeah. And what relation are you to Mr. Dow? Um, lay representative. A what, sorry? Lay representative. A lay representative? Yeah. Okay. And is he with you? Um, could be. Could be, okay. Can you bother on? Uh, well, the thing is, is there's not going to be any joinder given, I'm afraid, so... Oh, right, okay. So if he's not with you, then I'm going to have to leave the call, unfortunately. Well, the problem is, is that I am the man... Jonathan Dow, but I won't be acting um, as Mr. Jonathan Dow. I'll only be acting as myself as the lay representative, the okay. man. Then I'll leave the call with you there then, sir. So enjoy the rest of your day. Is that because you've not got joined her? No, it's because you're not the account holder. I'll tell you what then. What I'll do. I'll tell you what, let's I'll just... leave the call with you there. No, 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 let's just play the game, shall we? No, I'm not going to play anything. My name is Mr. Enjoy Jonathan Dow. Goodbye. Uh, can you stay a second? Ooh, didn't like that, did he? Better call back. Oh, right, this means... Oh, eight, four, four, five, eight, no. Oh, eight, four, four, five, six, one, eight, eight, oh, seven. Cheeky monkey. Oh, I don't know what's going on with me. Right, let's get to the... Uh... Good afternoon, and thank you. Please be advised that your call may be recorded for monitoring and training purposes. Really? Welcome to Equita. Please enter the Equita reference number. This is located at the top right hand corner of our correspondence. I'll give him joined, because uh, his paperwork's fraud. It's all a game, you. anyway. Please wait whilst we check your case details. Please wait. Your case is currently being reviewed by one of our collection teams to is an it? enforcement agent. When the enforcement agent visit, additional charges will become payable. Please really? choose from the following options. Press 1 to pay your debt in full. 
Press 2 if you would like to make. Please wait whilst I connect you to an operator. Please wait whilst I connect you to an operator. Show me three seconds. I'm just on the computer over here as well, sitting ready for it. Please? Yeah, sure. It's 1573. 1573. 8979. 8979. Name on the account? The name on the account, Jonathan Dow. Is that you? It is. Okay, can I take the first one of your address and postcode, please? You can. It's 147 Tamworth Road, Charlie Victor 9, 2 Quebec, Quebec. That's lovely. lovely so so you're, you're happy now that you've got some joinder, is that right? Sorry? Well, I've just phoned up a few seconds before I called you, and the chap I spoke to, he wouldn't continue with the call because I said that I was the lay representative for the Mr. version of me. I bet you don't get what I'm talking about, do you? I don't, sorry. There's two versions of every human. There's the person as a man or woman living flesh, and there's the um, administration version of them created by the government with the title Mr., Mrs., Miss, etc., Oh, right. Yeah, a bit of an eye-opener for you. Anyway, so, do you want to pull the account up then and see what you've yep. got so far? got it up. I've got a road traffic button at 157. Oh, what, sorry? 157. And have you got other notes on there from the previous phone call? I've got a phone call, a previous phone call, yeah, um, it didn't, go through, didn't get through completely with DPA. Is that all it says? It says um, just the man claimed to be... Mr. Um, Jonathan Dow, but didn't. The man claimed to be Mr. Jonathan Dow, but didn't? Yeah. Right, OK. That's new. <laughs> who was it that wrote... Who, who did the dealings last time, was it? I don't know. I don't have access to see who that was. I think, obviously, um, what you've explained now, I think, obviously, they've been a, been a bit confused about what's gone on, and, obviously, they've notified that they couldn't get through to DPA and the call was ended. Right, OK. What's the DPA? Yeah. What's that stand for? Data Protection Act. Ah, right, OK. Right, well, OK, then. So I've got your second letter here. OK. And I've been and took it to a solicitor today, and they've had a look at it for me. OK. And they've said that it's fake. It's fake? Yeah, there's no reverse liability on it. So, sorry, sir, so the letter we've sent you is fake? Correct, because there's no reverse liability. Um, I'm sorry that down now. Uh... You see, what I require of you, or of your company... You see on your letter where it's got yours sincerely and then it's got a nice font which is called Brush Script MT Sans, which is part of the Microsoft Word package of font types and graphics. And all it says on there is yours sincerely, Enforcement Manager, Equitor Limited. And that means that this is actually classed as mail fraud because there's nobody at your end who's making a demand to me who's prepared to put their human liability in the matter. Because they would be countersued by me in return. So this needs to just be thrown in the bin, according to the solicitor. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to put me on to a department manager? Yeah, give me two seconds. Let me see if I can find one available now, OK? Thank you. Multitasking, I've got a PC here and a Mac over this side, and I'm trying to get loads of uh, work done. Right, let's carry on doing the work while they're doing the bits.
happiness. Remember folks, emotionless and happy. Because we love everybody. Not so bailiffs, but the men and women behind the bailiff badge, we love that. Available at the moment, obviously, to discuss the account with yourself. Obviously, with the situation you have now, you would need to email in with your complaint. Uh, well, no, it's not a complaint, it's a statement. I mean, I want you to put these details against the account records, please. Okay. In fact, no, sorry, I require of you to put these uh, details onto the account records, please. I can, I can note them on the file, yeah, yeah, um, sir. But obviously, with this, obviously, I advise you would need to email in if there's any further, obviously. Anything else you want to go through any more? Right, could you read out what you've put then for me? Once I've you've typed I've it got the file obviously about the um, the letter that you stated that was because there's no reverse um, liability. Right. As, as the letter doesn't obviously state that um, there's got nobody's name on there to actually take demand from this. That's right. Have you also put a note down that this has come from a solicitor? I have put down this from a solicitor as well. Does the solicitor have the name? Do you want me to put that on there? No, because I never paid them. It was a free consultation. Oh, OK. I've noted that down as well for you. Brilliant. So what you've got there is the letter that you've sent to me doesn't have a real human being's name from your offices written in wet ink signature with their name printed underneath it. Yeah. Therefore, it classes as mail fraud. Yeah. There we go. So I'll, I'll chuck this one in the bin then. Okay. I, I have asked you guys before if you're going to come round because I'm actually from Beat the Bailiffs and the Banks and Response UK and we're waiting for you. Okay, I'll note that on the file as well. Oh, can you write one more thing down? Yep. I'll give you my YouTube channel. It, uh, we've already got it on the file. So oh, we've you do? YouTube channel, yeah. Can I give you a bit of personal advice? Yep. Have a, have a look at it on your own time and whatnot because it's quite an eye-opener. You either know all about the things that are going on already and you're just happy to act in it because yeah. it's I'll your job. I'll have to look at that when I finish work, sir. So okay. Oh, I've got one more question. Yep. You don't, you're not so I, do, I, I, I do have to go, so I do have uh, another key, um, call in the queue. Well, I just wanted to ask you, how long have you worked for Equita? For a, a while now. I, need, I, just, I do need to go to his other key, um, call yeah. in the queue. OK, then, that's great. What was your name, sorry? Vicky. Vicky? Yeah. Lovely. Thanks for that, and Nicky. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye. Oh, no, oh, yeah. I've got to go. I've got to go. Anyway, yeah. Oh, sorry, Vicky. All calls are recorded.